everybody. How are you? Good. That's great. Do you want to wave to everybody and say hello? Hi. Hi. Hello, everybody. All right. So did you have a great Easter? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You get lots of goodies? Mm -hmm. Yes. Awesome. All right. Now, what happened last Sunday that we were so excited about? What happened to Jesus? He died on the cross. He did. He, and then what happened on Easter Sunday morning? He, he rose back from the two That's right. He rose from the dead. Okay, I have something I want you all to do with me, okay? First, mm -hmm. I want you to take in a deep breath through your nose and then blow it out through your mouth and hold your hand out there as you're blowing, okay? So let's try that. Breathe it in, blow it out. Did you feel it? Yeah. yeah. Breath? All right, did you see it? No. No, you didn't see your breath, did you? Do we see our breath? No. I think we can sometimes. You want me to show you one way we can see it? Oh, when it's really cold Watch out. Watch this. Watch yeah. this. So, really cold out. You see my glasses? Yeah. Did you see my breath on there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. no. That's one way we can see our breath. Now I can't see on that side of my eye. How about in the winter time when we walk outside in the cold air and we we blow? What do we see? Uh, our, yeah. our breath. Sometimes we can see it and sometimes we can't, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna continue with our story now, okay? Oh, so Jesus bad. rose from the dead on Easter Sunday morning. And that evening, the disciples were so afraid that they were in a room together. They did not know what was going to happen to them because what the Jews were going to do to them. So they were hiding and they were scared. And then something happened. Jesus was in the room with them. Can you imagine how they felt? I bet they were so surprised. Do you think they were excited? Do you yes. think they were excited to see Jesus? Yes. And what do you think Jesus said to them? Don't be afraid. afraid. That's right. He said, peace be with you. And then, so that he, they would know that it was really him, he showed them his hand. The nails in his hands where they were, and in his side where he got got stabbed in his side, right? So they knew for sure that that was Jesus that was was there with them, and they were so excited. And then when he said to them again, he said again, "Peace be with you," and he said. As the Father sent me, so I am sending you. So he was telling them that they were going to go and do what he did while he was with them on earth. And that was to share the good news that Jesus forgave their sins and that they would be with him in heaven. Right? Well, you know what? One of the disciples was missing and his name was Thomas and the disciples told him that Jesus had come to see them and he didn't believe it would you believe it if you hadn't seen it's Jesus hard, would you believe it that he had come back it would be hard to wouldn't it but anyway and Thomas said to them he said well I'm not going to believe it until I see his hands and his side. So he kind of, he wasn't going to believe it, right? Until he saw it for himself. Now think about that breath we talked about. 
You know, sometimes we think we need to see things, right? But yet we know that it's our breath because we could feel it, right? And we know that if we're feeling it, that we're alive, right? Yep. Well, Thomas did get to see Jesus, and then he believed. Now, the other thing that Jesus said while he was with the disciples was that he was going to breathe on them the Holy Spirit so that they would have the power to go out and spread the word of Jesus' love and forgiveness to everyone they met. So, do you think that you all can do the same thing? Because we have the Holy Spirit also, and we can go out there and share God's word, right? What would you uh -huh. tell somebody about Jesus? Uh -huh. That he died for our sins. That's right. And they can be forgiven, right? Mm -hmm. And they don't have to worry about it. And all they have to do is love Jesus and tell others about him, right? Uh-huh. Yeah. Anybody else? All right. Well, let's have a prayer. And then you can go back to whatever it was you were doing, okay? And I'm so glad you all were here with us this week, and especially Lucas. I hope he can hear us. All right. So let's go our... Can you hear us? Yeah. Oh, For the first half of it, I couldn't, but then I pressed a button, and then I could. Oh, that's what we were afraid of, that you didn't have your button, your mute button was on. Well, it is so good to have you here. How much did you hear of the message? Well, well, for like the first half, I couldn't hear anything. For okay. like the first half. So did you, did you get to breathe with us and feel your breath on your hand? Well, Did you get to I, do that? I, I saw you do that, so I was like, like, well, I'll just follow you. I saw you do that, so I was just like, I'll follow you. Oh, that's great. All right. Well, we are so glad that you got to be here, Lucas, and hopefully you'll get to join us again, okay? All right. So let's let's have a prayer together, all right? Lord Jesus. We are amazed that you are our risen Lord and that you have given us the direction to do what you did while you were here on earth. Now we get to share your message with others so they too will have their sins forgiven to spend eternity with you. Amen. Thank you all so much. See you next week. Bye. See ya. Bye. 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 Bye.